just wanted to apologize to everyone who was watching the Resident Evil 2 live stream. Um, I'm not going to be able to um, finish it like I wanted to at all uh, because of, uh, well, I, I can't handle it. It's um, the mechanic of the game, uh, Mr. Tyrant, Mr. X, in the uh, previous iteration of the game, he uh, showed up, you fought him, and that was it. He might chase you for a few rooms, but he'd eventually give up, and, and that's it. And, uh, and that was that. Um, but here, it's uh, more akin to Alien Isolation, where he shows up, and he chases you. And you can't kill him. You could slow him down for a minute, but then he'll start chasing you again, and you can't get away. And then once you get to another room, it becomes uh, an instance of cat and mouse. Where is he? Is he in the next room? Did I lose him? Is he still chasing me? Am I about to run into him? Where is he? As an enemy, he's not really that scary. Once the fight starts, it's not bad at all. It's no different than fighting any other giant monster. It's the tension leading up to that contact, that where is he? Is he right around the corner? Am I going to open this door and there he is? Is he right behind me? Where is he? When is he going to show up? That that sense of tension, it's too much for me to handle. That That's the simple, honest truth. I, I just can't do it. So, um, maybe sometime months from now, when I've worked up the nerve, I can play the game again for myself and go through the whole thing and figure out how to handle Tyrant, how to how to deal with him, how to evade him and such, but for right now um, as far as live streaming it goes, that's not happening. That's not happening. Not until I know how to handle him. So I can't even play the game myself for fun right now. It's it's I already ejected the disc from the system, put it in its box, and put it on the shelf. I, I can't touch this game. So maybe, uh, maybe in a month or two, when uh, I stop being a little bitch baby, I can uh, I can handle this, but I can't right now. So, I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry.